I'm Jim. <laughs> You're Jim. I'm Rinda. And this is Lois. Now, I have known and Lois. And we're the Wilsons, right? <laughs> yes, we're all the Wilsons. <laughs> we are all the Wilsons. That's correct. Her last name is Wilson also. And we're Hardiness Approach. And we met two, two years ago? Yes. Two years ago at the first Homesteaders of America conference. The inaugural. And you went this year? No. Oh, you did it. Didn't go. We, we didn't came go. here instead. So, <laughs> she is from Manitoba, and we have been communicating for two years. And she finally showed up on our doorstep. <laughs> <laughs> Her husband is Ron and they have a large motor home that they brought out here and we just had tea and biscuits together and it was wonderful thank you you're welcome <laughs> and now we are going to show how to take a goat that doesn't like a stanchion and train it and she's the expert <laughs> here we go I'll try me <laughs> <laughs> come on up you come there we oh, go. Good girl. Come on, this way. Here, turn around. Come on, here. Let me put the I've got here. It's okay. So what the goal is is as long as she's standing still, she gets her oats. So I've got both hands on. Both hands are on the teats. And I could be milking her. <laughs> There's milk there. There is milk. I know. <laughs> so she's so, letting you. Yeah, she is. Okay. And she's more comfortable with both hands on the udder than one. So, okay. And I'm leaning into her because then I'm putting her against the wall. She's got nowhere to go. Okay. So if it was tighter. Yeah. Um, you know that uh, Justin uh, Rhodes' stanchion where he's got the board that yes. has it? Yep. Something like that would yeah. work really good because it would also keep her from backing up. Okay. And once they know that they're restrained where they can't get away, soon enough she's going to want to eat and not, enough. And not be uh, prancing around. She'll stand still, you'll get your milk, she'll eat, and everybody's happy. Okay, so every day we bring her up. Yeah, and, and she uh, we could milk her, so because she does yeah. have milk. Yeah, and, and could we increase the supply by milking her? Yeah, just like a mama. Mm -hmm. So are her little ones on her still? They I they'd love to they'd be. love to be. She kicks them off. Oh, okay. So if you separated her, then because they probably are stealing. If you separated her at night, you'd get more milk in the morning, and then just leave her during the day with them and and that. But you see how now I'm touching her and she's bouncing around? Yeah. But so, I move in. You move in on her and she's standing. And I'm I'm I could be milking out the milk right now. Okay. But I don't want to get the stand and full of milk. Okay. There's not much there, so. But you see how I've got my whole hand on there, like it's way easier to milk. Her. Yeah. And trying to do it with the fingers. Okay, let me see. So you're, I've got both hands on and I'm, oh yeah. Okay. But as soon as I yeah. move away and try doing it without holding her in, and it, yeah, and even if it's your body that's doing it, she's going to be, if they, if she trusts you, She's going to stand there. Okay. Like, no, I'm not against her. She's thinking, well, no, you can go. Oh, good girl. And so, how about this little one then? Should we be bringing her up? Yes. It, the sooner you start getting him used to being on the stanchion, the sooner the, uh, the easier it will be to, to okay. milk them when they are ready to be milked. Okay, so let me watch. Grab another little collar here. Yeah. <laughs> if all else fails. <laughs> She's small enough, I can get away with it. Get back, get back, get back. Ah, 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 ah. Can you get him? <laughs> Escape artist, get in. Get back. 
So if she knows that the, the reward is here, okay, we're going to have to put that down here for now because she's not tall enough. Okay. Yeah. okay. So. There so there go. again, it's just getting them used to it. So now what you do is, uh, is um, get her used to touching the udder and just overall. And if she kicks up a stink, you take away her food and she knows that if she wants those treats that she's got to stand nice and still. Hey, Millie. Yeah, she, she's got no inclination to do what her mommy does. So. Right. I don't think there'd be any problems here. And, and like with the older doe right now, she's had the kids on her and she's trying to wean them off herself. So she will be kicking them off um, and she will kick us off too because she's like, okay, I don't want this to happen. Whereas her, she's got no reason to be chasing no. anybody off. But if you're doing that now, then she's going to continue to stand all the time yeah, because it's like, oh, you've been doing this, I get my yeah. treats. It's all it's a good thing. It. So if she's not tall enough to get her head in the stanchion there, you might have to build oh, a platform you know what? on there. I hate to tell you this, but we put it on the wrong one. That one's the male. <laughs> So you, you that is not Millie. <laughs> <laughs> that is Millie. You made out like a bandit. <laughs> <laughs> okay, which one is Millie? <laughs> the dark one. <laughs> I, I thought I maybe I was wrong. I was going to say something and then I was like, oh, I won't do that. <laughs> oh, but, but funny. guess what? The males do have so those it's this one too. Yeah, that's the one, one. that was biting you. The, oh, yeah. <laughs> Come here, sweetie. We're gonna let you out now. Okay. It was the one that had got now. <laughs> She'll come back. She'll just go eat weeds. Watch, watch. <laughs> okay. Do you want her to know that there's cheats here? See? Look what we got there for you. Okay, now we're doing it with the right one. <laughs> <laughs> so, and uh, if this is the only place they're going to get it, all you have to do is open the gate and they're going to get up on the stanchion because they know that's where they're going to get okay. the green. Okay. So you just, like you want to come in even from behind, like this way too. And the more relaxed you get with them, uh, or they get relaxed with you touching them, the easier it's going to be when they actually um, have their their uh, little ones and you can start milking. Didn't give her too much, did we? No. I didn't put much in there. Okay. All right, this is Millie. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Millie, you got you right this time, huh, sweetie? <laughs> yeah. But you noticed when you first started, she really she, hunched she up, like, but now this? she's already this? Yeah. she's already loosening up because it's like, okay, nothing's going to happen. I'm just going to eat my grain, and she's she's quite relaxed with it. So it's yeah. just spending the time, and if every day. She knows that you're going to come out and give her something in there. You'll soon, she'll be at the gate waiting to come in and she'll come out and pop up pop there. Up. And So we just need to not give them to her in there at all. Yeah. That's the only no. time she gets it. Yeah. If, but if you get the routine going where they know that if you're, they're coming out here, they're going yeah. to have the grain all to themselves. They're not going to be fighting with the others. Yeah. Uh, she'll be there waiting to come out. Or once they're getting closer to, to kidding, you want to feed them more grain anyway than just that. They should probably get a couple of times a day. Okay. Because it just helps to have healthy babies. Yeah. And for leading too, like if you if initially to get her to lead good, you can use the, that as enticement too so she's not pulling, that she's coming with you instead. Come here. Come here. Yeah, come here. Look. No. Yeah, this was all good stuff. I didn't have to fight anybody for feed and Yeah. 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 
And that sound will call her too. Come on. Come on. That's how we get them back in. If we just do that with them. Come on. Come on. That's it. Good oh, girl. Good girl. There you go. Oh, look at that. There you go. Good girl. So there, you can call her out and just lead her, make sure she jumps up before she gets any, and she'll soon, you'll open that gate and she'll be up here because oh, she knows. Oh, that's great. Yeah. That's great. Okay. Good girl. Well, thank you for the lesson. You're welcome. <laughs> <laughs> you can't get your nose in there. It's too little.